welcome at OYOT. We will introduce you uh, in La Grande Motte with uh, hopefully the sunshine, uh, our brand. The very difference uh, with all yachts is that we only focus uh, for owners. O means owner dedicated yachts. We have uh, a couple of uh, uh, molds to choose from, to choose the size. So it will come from eight meters and uh, we finish with 21 and 24 meters. Uh, we're gonna visit the class four. That is a, a sample of our production. The style is made by uh, Dentley Ford. So we have a, a specific wave design made to have a curve and to have something appealing. On this boat, uh, that is a 46 feet, class four, you have a steering on the left, on the right, sorry. On another boat, you're gonna have two wheels. Uh, on a, another boat that is being built, we have a central steering. It's really your decision. The main thing regarding all yachts is really safety first. This is uh, for us the main argument. So for safety, we have few solutions. The first solution is strength. The boats or yachts are made to be extremely strong. So for instance, we will go in the front and you will realize that uh, the building is quite different from the front. Usually you will find uh, the front beam that is a piece of aluminum and it's bolted. In this old yacht, this old piece, the old cross, is a carbon. And so 11 pieces of carbon and everything is hand laminated to have, it's not bolted, it's hand laminated to have the boat to be solid as a rock. I mean, you don't want to, to have the boat uh, noisy or whatever when you're gonna face uh, a sea that you should never have faced, but that might happen as well. So inside, you will also understand that the building is really made for uh, strength, which is argument number one for safety. Uh, on this boat, we decided to set up a carbon uh, fiber uh, sails very easy to to handle and for this uh, mast we decided to go with uh, a rotative mast carbon rotative mast with a very specific solution uh, for people to to manage all the sails so to take a reef as you know uh, with those masts rotative you really want to lock everything on the mast. You don't want to lock the things behind because it's twisting. It's not really the best solution. And anyway, blocking all the early yards on the, on the mast is really the, the must. So we didn't want to come with a big hole in the mast. So we decided to make a pedestal where everything goes, early yards, or racing and within a, a simple I mean place you can manage the reefing and you can manage the halyard then you finish with the cannon gum I mean it's uh, it's made to be uh, easy the very good thing with rotative mast is that you it's very easy to to reef I would say uh, you don't have to stop the boat and be in front of the sea uh, to reduce the, the mainsail because you're going to twist the mast in front of the wind and you're going to leave the self tacking with an angle. So you will continue, you, you will never be stopped and then the sail will go down easily. But as usual, this is owner's decision, whether you want to have rotative mast carbon or you want to have fixed aluminum 
I mean, all those things are easy to set up. Performance means safety. I mean, you need to rely on the boat to be able to go away when you're gonna have with the forecast pretty bad. These boats are really made to be fast, but I would say fast and easy. This means that usually it's a couple, so we manage all solutions to have a couple or a person alone being able to, to manage the boat. The key point for any multi-hull is weight. If you want to have a performance boat, you need to have a light boat. You will realize, uh, checking the specification, that we have uh, for an 11 meter, you, we have a, a 3.5 uh, tone. For this boat that is 46 feet, 14 meter, it's uh, seven and a half ton. And if you want to understand the weight of a complete boat ready to sail with the tender, with the engine, with food, with extra sails, with, I mean, everything on the boat. The last time we lifted this boat, we saw 8.2 with fuel inside. I mean, not full, half full. It's regarding performance, the sister ship, which is the same hull, uh, that has been built also in uh, Riga, in the shipyard uh, of uh, Riga. The, the boat was in the competition for the ARC 2014 and is being rated in the race section, number one. And out of all the competition, it came number five overall. Regarding this class four, that is a, a 46, uh, 14 meters, uh, on the new models that we launch, we now have been able to expand the cockpit. Uh, we did not reduce this platform because, I mean, people just love it. When they use the boat, this is the best place to put your tender. Uh, the tender actually can be quite big. Uh, we managed to put uh, an aluminum six meter, six people with uh, a 10 horsepower tender. So. On this boat, you have a mechanism that is pivoting. I mean, very simple solution, okay? And for some other boats, we decided to go with davits. I mean, traditional davits. The thing is that for transatlantic, it's excellent to be able to have the, the tender safe and locked on the boat, not outside. Uh, this is also the perfect place for sand uh, bathing. And also the kids love to just go and uh, dive from this platform. It needs to be a pleasure boat. Uh, when it comes to uh, design of the Biminis, you, you, you really need to, to, to design it uh, your style. This means that some people want to have a long one, some people want to have a short one. That is owner's decision, as usual. Same thing for this bulkhead. People can decide to have an opening here, People can decide to have a big opening in the middle. I mean, it's your boat, so it needs to be your decision. Um, we mentioned safety a few minutes ago, and we pointed out that argument number one is strength. You need to have a yacht that is solid as a rock. When you will enter the boat, you going to realize that everything that goes inside the boat that is non-structural will become structural. For instance, we going to see uh, just a simple panel that is a kitchen. The kitchen most of the time is made, I would say, in a, in a big place and a carpenter and then they take all everything to put inside the boat. In a no yacht, it's just impossible because this panel that is wood covered is actually an infused panel. Then we, uh, you will see from inside that this is really an infused panel. Uh, the big difference is that we're going to pass hours and hours to have all those panels hand stratified, I mean laminated, uh, we put uh, 
glass, we put resin, and then we sand, and then we put again. I mean, it's uh, thousands of hours to make everything that is coming inside the boat to make it structural. So the seating is the same. This is uh, uh, made out of uh, infusion <coughs> and then covered with wood, but we could cover it with uh, anything. Basically, uh, you need to have a boat where you have no noise. So when we're going to step down, it's just impossible to have a noise of uh, something that is crack, crack, crack. It's just impossible. Um, this uh, boat has been finished by, uh, with, I mean, some distinguished uh, finish. This is handmade in France and uh, positioned exactly in a way to not to have people being hurt with, uh, uh, I mean, all the, all needs to be around. We offer different styling for the, for the finish. Uh, we also like to work with material which are pretty exclusive, where it's almost, in, I mean, it's very difficult to scratch those materials. It's made out of uh, nanoparticles. And uh, we find it extremely convenient because it's light. It's 0 0.9 millimeter, so extremely light compared to Corian. We decided to focus on the sea view. You're going to be living on a boat and you're going to be living on the sea. I think that at least you deserve to have a sea view. So we always pay attention to have a uh, a perfect vision when people are seated or they are standing up. So wherever you are, you will always be able to have a perfect view. Most of the time, I would say that people feel very comfortable with this styling, having a, a kind of a lounge a position where you just relax. But as usual, this is owner's decision to set up. Uh, we have a quite, uh, quite a few examples of uh, layout for inside. I think that on the website you will find about eight. Uh, but anyway, they will not be the, your, uh, your layout because it needs to be your boat. You will realize that you really have a master cabin. Uh, the boat uh, has, uh, I mean, this is a 46 feet. 14 meters and you have a, a bed that is more than 165 in large, which is quite good. As usual, nice finish is important. Uh, protecting the edge with aluminum because this is your investment and we need to protect it. We will visit also the bathroom that is uh, with a design made by Clifford with the usual wave design. And it's also, I would say, very functional. The front cabin, as usual, can be positioned in the way you want. If we raise up the, the, the bed, for sure you will have a larger bed. I think it's also very convenient to have as much as possible places to uh, put your things. Once you decided on the length of the boat, you will uh, come to us and explain exactly what you want, what you don't want, and then you're going to fix the budget. Once we know the length of the boat and we have the budget with all the specifications from you, we can uh, exactly uh, express the, the specifications of the exact boat that you will uh, uh, that you will get. Usually, building takes about three months for a small boat like an 11 to maximum a year for a 21 meter. Uh, we work with molds, and once the the infusion is made, uh, everything that will go inside the boat will be your choice. So we will assist you for sure in all those choices we are extremely competitive. We can 
range, the pricing for a 14 meters, I mean complete, not a marketing price, but complete, you think about a range between 370 up to 750. It all depends on the carbon options and all these comfort options. So I hope you enjoyed uh, the visit. Hopefully, thanks to the Salon du Multicoque uh, to have uh, such a nice exposure around. And we will be delighted to have your project exposed to our uh, technical guys to be able within a few days to give you the final answer and the final proposal for you to be happy with your kids, with your wife, with your family in a safe place. Thank you so much.